much fun. These people like belt it out. They're like, no, yeah. I can't sing for my life, but it was a blast. We had a good time. This is Ellen Stardust Diner, the only place in the world where you can dine while being serenaded by Broadway's upcoming stars. If you're planning a trip to New York, you've inevitably come across some conflicting views. So today we're going to be checking it out and taking you along. We're here at about 11 a.m. on a Saturday and the line is already pretty long. One of people's main criticisms with Ellen's is how crazy the lines can get. Because so many people are trying to time their meal with a show, there can be some big rushes. We're here just a couple hours before most matinees, so it's probably one of the busier times. They don't take reservations, and I've heard of the line getting as long as two hours, so make sure to take that into consideration. Let's go see how long this takes. Ellen's Stardust Diner is located on 51st and Broadway, just a few blocks from Times Square. It's been here since 1987 and is known for its singing servers, many of whom have gone on to perform on Broadway. We've both been here a few times. Growing up on Long Island and in New Jersey, a show in the city and dinner at Stardust is the quintessential suburbanites night out in the city. So we're excited to see if this place has the same magic we thought it did as kids. We already sat down, we only waited like 25 minutes and the show is starting. We heard a song from Anastasia and I am so happy right now. I love Broadway music and their voices are just incredible. So I am really gonna enjoy this. Let's pick out what we're gonna eat. Let's take a look at the menu. It's pretty much your classic American diner fare from burgers and sandwiches to all day breakfast options. It's definitely pricey, even for the city, but you are paying for the entertainment. And honestly, an extra five to $10 a meal for this kind of experience, I think is justified. They're really going song after song. I'm having a blast, but we just got our food. I got an omelet with some tater tots and Will got a breakfast burger. So let's see how it is. The food isn't bad either. You're not coming for the food. They know people would come regardless, so I appreciate their putting some effort into making it good. Now it's time for this video to get demonetized. Nothing 
nothing but the highest budget for you. You're welcome. So By the way, we left just before 2 and there was no wait at all. Alan Stardust is so much more than just a diner. Should you come here just for the food? Of course not. It's pretty expensive, but the experience is one of a kind. Whether you're coming to see a show or just want a taste of Broadway, you can't go wrong with Stardust. But make sure you give yourself enough time to wait in line. Well, if you like this video, be sure to give us a like and subscribe and let us know in the comments if you've come to this iconic diner before and where else we should go. See you in the next one.